Hey guys, my name is Alan and welcome back. Today I'm going to talk about the vegan smokescreen and why a lot of vegans seem to be falling down the rabbit hole because of it. A vegan smokescreen typically arises when a vegan confuses and or conflates human issues with non-human animal issues. For example, comparing human oppression with animal oppression. When vegans conflate the two, they often unknowingly can find themselves in a state of cognitive dissonance and a lot of vegans are in a state of cognitive dissonance. There's a lot of people within the vegan community who are foaming at the mouth to try and hijack the vegan narrative. And the vegan narrative has been hijacked by certain groups and individuals, namely the apologists and the intersectionalists, to fulfill their stupid, twisted, selfish, cuntish, oh look at me, I'm a victim too, agendas. The meat, dairy and egg industries are shitting themselves because they know that veganism is rising, they know that animal liberation is rising, and they know that people are waking up. So they have no other option than to pull out all the stops in a desperate attempt to demotivate the vegan movement. Vegan YouTubers like Unnatural Vegan, The Cuntitarian, Fully Fake Christina, and The Not So Vegan Cheetah have sold their souls to the devil. They're puppets to these industries, and they will literally say and do anything to satisfy their sponsors. Their role is to twist the vegan narrative and to get people second-guessing veganism. In other words, their role is to rob a real vegan's compassion towards animals and divert that towards humans. Now, don't get me wrong, humans of every race, colour and creed have been subjected and continue to be subjected to incredible oppression and injustice but it's nothing compared to what the animals go through it's not even on the same page it's not even on the same planet it's not even in the same universe the collateral caused by non-human animal oppression will never be matched not in a million light years every second of every minute of every hour of every day animals are ground up alive because of their gender they're castrated without anesthetic they're stolen from their families they're de-beaked they're dehorned they're branded with hot irons, they're thrown into tiny spaces, they're raped against their will, their babies are stolen off them, and when they're no longer profitable to these industries, they're sent to slaughter. They're hung upside down, they have their throats slit, they're chopped up into a thousand pieces and thrown into a pretty little package with a barcode to their name. Speciesism is the first form of hatred human beings are taught growing up. Every other form of discrimination stems from speciesism. So if we can eradicate speciesism at its core, then we can worry about every other form of discrimination. So my advice to vegans is to stay fully focused on the animals, the real victims, and not to allow yourself to get sucked into debating human issues. If you like the video, give it a big thumbs up. If you like my content, subscribe. And remember, veganism is not about being perfect. It's about doing the most amount of good and the least amount of harm. Bye.